hi everyone welcome back to my channel a uh, long time no see the past two videos that I posted have been Photoshop and Adobe Illustrator kind of videos um, but today I wanted to come on here and let you guys know kind of what's going on in my life so you guys will know what to expect kind of where my channel is going so as you guys have noticed I changed my YouTube name from photo fanatic one to creative geek studio and that is because I plan on filming a lot of my um, kind of work little setup here um, so yeah so that is one of the things but I want to include some of the old vlogging style kind of videos so as you guys know it is almost back to school time I know some students are in school um, here where we live they are not in school yet so um, yeah with that being said we me and the kids both have uh, we all have a meeting tomorrow we have two meetings one for Milo and one for Jade and that meeting is for the completion of their homeschool enrollment yes I will be homeschooling my kids um, I will not be doing a private homeschool there's different ways you can homeschool private homeschool means that I would have to do the lesson plans and all of that and keep track of everything I am not doing it that way I could not do that it that way and thankfully where we live in the state we have an option of putting our kids in public school still in the public school system so that they have a teacher and you know they do the curriculum stuff but the awesome thing is that one they get to stay home two they still get things like field trips and social um, gatherings and stuff so uh, the way our schedule will be will be much more flexible in the beginning when I first like applied to get them into the school I was really a little bit nervous because the public school system is like all that I know that's all I know I don't know anybody that's homeschooled I've never been homeschooled myself um, and yeah nobody's ever talked to me about homeschooling but I had to do a lot of research on my own this is something that I've been wanting to do for a while now even when Jade was little it's something that I've always considered um, but yeah so that could be a whole nother video as to what led me up to this point I guess but um, basically Jade is going into sixth grade at her regular school that is considered middle school but here it is still cons uh, in the home school here in the home school it is still considered elementary and then seventh and eighth grade are the middle school so to me in my eyes I still see her as a middle schooler um, but yeah we have our appointment tomorrow to finish signing off all the paperwork and once that's done I can go ahead and withdraw them from the schools the actual physical schools that I had them enrolled in so yeah in the beginning I was a little bit nervous especially for Milo because uh, I know that we had it like we pumped him up to go to physical school Damien thinks that maybe I should still put him in physical school but when I talked to Milo about it I just let him know like hey you know like I can take you to school but I just like I don't think he realized that like I wasn't gonna be there and Milo is my child that is really attached to me Jade is more of a social butterfly Milo is too but he loves for me to be there and that's not a reason as to why I'm homeschooling I mean I know he would thrive in a school setting as well so I don't know we're gonna try out TK homeschool um, he's still gonna have a teacher we're gonna do a lot of socializing and all that stuff but I think my biggest thing especially for Jade now that she's getting a little bit older is I was not happy with some of the things that were going on in fifth grade for Jade keep in mind that this was the first year back after a whole year off a year and a half off since COVID hit so 
Um, so maybe that could have been why, I'm not sure, but I also remember being a young kid and how out of control everything was. But my biggest thing is that I want age appropriate learning. I don't want my kids being exposed to things or to words and conversations and ideas by other kids whose parents don't regulate their home and don't, you know, censor their homes for their children. Yes, I, I, like, yes, you have to talk about certain things to your kids that are uncomfortable or things that really happen in the world, but do I believe that, that the age 10 and 11 are the age to be talking about those things? No. If my daughter has a question, yes, I answer them. Being in fifth grade and being exposed to like all these conversations that kids were having, she was having a lot of questions that could only have been coming from school because here at home I do censor their video games. I censor their, like I am supervising, I guess, their conversations, um, like what they're doing, what they're playing. I am aware of all of it. So. With that being said, I think that homeschooling is the best decision that I can do. Of course, this doesn't mean it's gonna be forever. This is our first year trying it. I already am really excited. They're very excited, Milo especially. Jade is too. She's like excited that she doesn't have to go to school. Um, she doesn't have to deal with the drama, she says. <laughs> Even though she's very social, she loves her friends. But another thing is that once they are in public school, they have to pause their learning if other kids are not um, listening. Like, there's only one teacher and so many students. So here at home, they're gonna have me. We've already been homeschooling. This is our third week. Um, so we've been homeschooling aside from the actual school because again, they don't start school until another week or two but tomorrow is the day that we're gonna finalize everything. So, the kids are back now, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this video. That's Jade. Koi is crying because they're here and he wants to get out of his house. So, we're gonna go ahead and end the video here. Okay, so we're gonna end the video here because we have to take Koi out and I have to finish working. I'm actually making an 80s garland um, to send out ship today and I have to make a Selena shirt so I need to stop recording um, but I will see you guys very soon we are excited to make videos for you guys and I'm actually really excited for this journey and I know the kids are too so we will see you guys in our next video I need to create a schedule to be more consistent here on YouTube I've been working on of course multiple things but kind of narrowing it down to the things that I've been seeing growth on and stuff so I will See you guys in my next video.